We're on our way to see Velcro Pygmies. What was it called? The Velcro. Velcro Pygmies. Okay. Atima. Okay. Yeah. Rock <laughs> the docks. It's the last show for the summer. The summer. Until next year. Hey, look, who's that? Bubba Gump. Remember that? What movie was that? What movie was that? Bubba Gump. Forrest Gump. She's mighty, mighty. She let me all hang out. She's a black house girl. Who made a spag and that's a fact. They hold that number. Turned from Afghanistan injured. And each of them had a flag in their hand. And they said, This is the first time we've ever seen this band, and we love this band. If we gave you these flags, would you put them on stage with you every night? Those of you that have seen us know that these flags have been on our stage every single night. They are there every night. Every time we play, they're with us. They had another request. They said, would you ask other servicemen and women to autograph them? Sure. And so at this point, there's thousands of names, thousands on each of these flags. Many of those names are people from right here in Houston, Texas. Many of the names of the people that are on these flags are people that never came home. Paid it all, 100% sacrifice. So that we could come out on Thursday night and raise hell if we want to, to rock it off. There's some people that are bringing the chaos to the shores of America. And at this point, what stands between us and chaos are the police officers and the firefighters and the humans. And what happened in Baton Rouge and what happened in Dallas, Texas was disgusting. But what it demonstrated was a heroism that you don't see much anymore. And I'm watching TV, and I'm watching men and women that are not running away from danger, but they're running to it to protect all of us. And so this song is now dedicated not only to the brave men and women of the United States military, but to, a, to America's brave first responders that keep us safe right here at home.